Hello friends, welcome to Tutorials Point. In this video, we will talk about the job heat map. So using job heat map, you can visualize a job graph as either jobs in progress or job time, data that is read or data that is written. So we will see a demo of this now. To look at a job heat map, primary condition is that a job graph must be created and displayed. And to look at the different kinds of heat map, just go to display here and by default it displays progress like for example how it has progressed which means that if it is running it will be showing blue, if it is success it will be showing green. If you change it to time, it will get updated and the extreme colors like uh, towards the right end of the VIPGR spectrum which is towards red and orange will indicate that this has taken a lot of time and this has taken less time. So it's the same with the data read as well. So this particular node or stage has read some amount of data, has read a lot of data. If you see the read is nothing but uh, let me maximize the read is 31.6 kilobyte whereas the others the read is in bytes and that's the reason why it's indicating that this particular stage has read a lot of uh, data. And if you see for written, this particular stage has written a lot of data and if you see the data is in kilobytes whereas for the others it is in bytes. So you can use this job heat map to analyze your nodes or to analyze your stages and uh, to basically give you insight of how the job has been processed. Thank you.